Hey YouTubers, it's Tony with Mayberry Mini Trucks. Today we have a vehicle that we recently imported from Japan. This is a Subaru Sambar. And this is a video that we had already recorded, but I had to record it again. So um, you may have already seen this truck. So I'm just uh, giving you a heads up in case that is the case. So the stock number is SB. 8896. This is a 4x4, four four, 5 speed with extra low 1. It has 24,410 miles and it is $7,200. So let's go ahead and do our walk around. Starting with the upper corner, it looks nice it's very straight and coming down the pillar it's straight and the door also looks straight um, it does have a dent here the tires are in good shape and it does have a like a scratch right there that's been touched up but it's not body damage it is a scratch and it has been touched up so just to let you know that um also i try to get under here to show people what kind of condition this is in underneath and the word that would describe that is very good. So it's in very good condition underneath the vehicle, which is probably more important than the exterior. You know, what's under the wrapper, so to speak. So the back looks good. I'm going to go ahead and open this. <clears throat> this allows us to see what kind of shape the bed is in and the bed's in really good shape um you can see the sides a little dirty like that is a rust stain um and the back is in good condition the bed sides are in good condition i want to show you here let me close this This is what kind of shape it's in up against the cab wall. This is um, like a urethane that the factory puts on. It's cracked. Um, and up there, it actually has a little bit of rust damage there. Not anything serious. You can tell that the guy tried to re put like um, uh, touch-up paint on it. Uh, it's not serious, but I want to make sure you see everything so here's the top of the cab and here's the side looks nice it does have some damage right here this is like a popular spot for vehicles because if you remember the other side had the same thing and that is not the first time I've had a mini truck um, where people like hit gas pumps or something, I don't know, in Japan. And that is a very popular place for there to be. Um, and, and, and like I said, right there. So it's the same spot on a lot of mini trucks. Okay, here's the interior. Here's the door. It's dirt, not rust. The seat does have a split on it. It's probably nine inches long, I'd say.
All right, so we'll go ahead and the passenger door panel and the passenger seat look good. Let's go ahead and take it for a drive. I already know this one didn't shut the door. This one drives well. Um, you know, Subarus are kind of different. They made them four cylinders. Now, don't think that that means, oh, you've got 25% more horsepower because the engine size is the same. You don't have extra horsepower. I will just tell you, you do not have extra horsepower. However, it's every bit as good and it's a little smoother. It is a smoother running truck because you're dividing the um, ignitions by four instead of by three. So it's a little smoother running vehicle for that reason. Subaru, they have like a, like a, a cult following. It's almost, you know, the people who love Subarus, you couldn't possibly talk them into anything else. And Subaru does make really good stuff. Um, and the mini truck is no exception. And the Japanese have been making mini trucks for probably 60 years. And they really know how to do it. Um, Subaru included. So now we're going to turn around and do our tight U-turn. I really like mini trucks a lot because they get really good gas mileage. They run well, plenty of power. We're in fourth gear right now and we're climbing this hill. Uh, it's this pretty steep hill and we're accelerating up this hill. Um, that's a great sign. That means that the engine has lots of power. Um, if you're interested in this truck, let us know and uh, you can call us at 336-777-9957. Or you can email us at sales at mayberryminitrucks.com. You can check out our website at Mayberry, mayberryminitrucks.com. Or you can... All right, you can call us at 336-777-9957. So thank you for your interest and thanks for watching our video.